Senate Democratic incumbents be the death knell for the party's hopes of maintaining control of the Senate. Extemporaneous speaking, or extemp, is a seven-minute commentary on current events. Speakers will take a position on a question about international or United States affairs, establishing a thesis responding directly to a selected question, with only 30 minutes to prepare. Because the speech is persuasive in nature, it's helpful to review Aristotle's three modes of persuasion, ethos, pathos, and logos. Ethos, or ethical appeal, establishes credibility through convincing the audience on the character of the author. This is done through delivery and use of evidence in the speech. Pathos appeals to the emotions of the audience. Logos is persuasion through the use of reason, or logic. In addition to the modes of persuasion, there are three key areas to consider when evaluating extemp argumentation and analysis, source consideration, and delivery. Argumentation and analysis. Students should organize an approach to the questions examining critical areas of analysis. For example, in the question, what can be done to improve the economy, students should look to significant components that make an economy work. A student might examine the impact of major markets, such as commodities or stocks and bonds, or critical indicators like interest rates or consumer confidence. The key is that students answer the question posed by determining the most important aspects of the economy and explain why those components are most vital in their analysis. Students should convince the audience of a clear understanding of the topic area. Source consideration. Students establish credibility through their analysis of source material. Students should cite their sources during the development of the speech. Citations may include the source of the material and the date. Judges should take into consideration the variety and quality of sources students are considering. For example, in our question about what can be done to improve the economy, sources such as the financial section of the Wall Street Journal or the New York Times or The Economist may be considered. As you evaluate, it's important to weigh the source material and how it affects the credibility of the speaker. Delivery. Judges should take into consideration the major areas of delivery such as use of voice, movement, and expression. The speaker should employ ethos, or credibility in their speech, through a confident demeanor. Note how the speaker can refine delivery, indicating how he or she may improve eye contact, presence, and emotion. Pitch, tone, pacing, and volume should be employed to express the pathos, ethos, and logos of the argument. It's important to note, the students only have 30 minutes to brainstorm, research, outline, and deliver a speech. Therefore, minor fluency issues may not weigh as much in the judge's assessment of the quality of the speech. Argumentation and analysis, source consideration, and delivery should be employed together in assessing the overall quality of the speech. Thank you for judging and enjoy the experience.